All right, so it's a little bit later in the day. You can see the sun is going down and it's starting to get kind of dark in here. But a lot of things have been changed. I've gone ahead and let me see if I can set this up so you can look through the magnifying glass. I've set this up so these two 0.1 microfarad capacitors that were in the uh, inverter stage have been removed and replaced with, um, or no, these 0.022 microfarad caps came out and I moved them over all the way to the input side of channel one, the base channel. So they're all the way down here now at this point to make this tone stack a little bit more like a Marshall. So the point ones that came from down here, the treble and the base um, filtering circuits were actually moved down here where as it turns out, the um, other earlier baseman design the AA864 design actually specifies 0.1 microfarad capacitors in this inverter circuit. So I put them in over there. Additionally, to make this more like the AA864 circuit, I removed these 220, 220k ohm resistors from coming back to the plates of the power tubes. These were like feedback resistors to the plates and from what what I've read they're they're real tone saps and uh, they can they kill a lot of that old classic blackface um, interactive tone. So I've removed them temporarily. They're still hanging on by one side. Um, as far as other things that have been done I have utilized the ground lift switch which was already bypassed I found um, in order to run a pair of black leads and you'll see them running here this is high quality wire hopefully I don't run into a shielding issue and what I've done is I've put a 6.8k ohm resistor switchable in parallel with the 47k ohm resistor Let me see if I can find it. The 47k ohm resistor right here. And that is also a feedback resistor that comes from the uh, secondary of the output transformer. It comes all the way back to the input stage of the inverter. So that also, according to my reading, it has been a bad decision when CBS took over Fender. So I've reduced on a switch, I've made that um, alterable back and forth. I've re reduced uh, that resistance to 6.8 6 .8 kilo ohms, uh, switchable between 6.8 and back to 47K. I left the 0.1 microfarad capacitor in that circuit haven't removed that yet, but I do understand that there, there are designs that actually take this straight to ground with no capacitor right there. And at this point, I would like to get a good picture of the base pot on the base input, which is about to get swapped out. This is a 250K audio taper pot, and uh, it's got a 6.8 kilo ohm resistor uh, performing the the middle um, pass filter circuit resistance. So I'm going to go ahead and remove these wires from this pot and pull it out and add a 1 mega ohm audio taper pot, which again is closer to that of a Marshall circuit. We're going to be done here pretty quickly and we're going to see how this sounds.